Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel and in this video I will show you how to fix black screen for your RPCS3 on your PC. So let's get started. As you can see on my computer screen, so first solution is guys I have different solutions of this problem on your RPCS3 so do not skip any part of this video. So first solution of this problem. Uh, go to configuration options and go to CPU options and but first I close it and uh, if you want to use your uh, uh, if you want to fix black screen for your game then create a custom configuration file go to change custom configuration and uh, restore your default settings from here and apply and save custom configuration after selecting default settings go to configuration again and go to CPU options and over here guys some games are workable recompiler ASMGIT if you are using recompiler LLBM then select this one and after selecting recompiler ASMGIT select from here 4 or 2 but I recommend 4 and click on mega and enable SPO loop detection and go to GP options and uh, over here very important thing do not skip it guys over here uh, renderer and uh, uh, if you want uh, select this one disable video output if you select this one disable video output then you can face black screen with sound and you can select from here OpenGL or Vulkan uh, some games workable with OpenGL and some games workable with Vulkan so you can try both options but I recommend Vulkan because Vulkan is better than OpenGL for performance and fix many issues on, uh, on your RPCS3 so after selecting your GPU device make sure you have the latest version drivers for your GPU if you want to use Vulkan with your GPU device then make sure you have latest version drivers uh, go to search bar on your windows and type here device manager device manager control panel and uh, go to your uh, display adapter and right click and prop these and go to details and drivers you can see over here your driver version driver right if you have older version drivers for your GPU then please update it first now okay and uh, for more settings to fix black screen on your RPCS3 check this option and check this option and uh, over here right color buffer if you are using demon soul game then it's very important option to fix black screen on your RPCS3 check this option right color buffer and check this option and select 4 from here and frame limit off from here otherwise you can select 60 but I select off and uh, I disable it this one and select your default resolution uh, recommend it or any other one but I, I recommend this one uh, by default and go to advanced options and enable uh, two options from here read color buffer and select from here fast and uh, uh, over here uh, select the unlimited default from here and check this option uh, debug console mod and uh, rx reservation access and apply and save and the right click again change custom configuration advanced options and driver wake up 200 us and uh, make sure your settings are completed and same but uh, uh, I did not save my uh, settings from here I recheck it and fast and uh, GPU check it check it and uh, okay and 4 off and disable and it's very important thing guys select this one 60 by 9 if you select this one then you can face black screen uh, issue on your RPCS3 then select this one and uh, yeah check it and unlimited default apply and save 
and for more settings right click and uh, go to display settings and uh, scroll down graphic settings and remove your old application file from here and browse and go to your rpcs3 application file you want to use so this is my application file add options and high performance and save and close it and one more important thing guys if you have recently updated your rpcs3 then you can face black screen with sound uh, on your rpcs3 then go to help check for update again and you can see your version is already up to date and uh, close it and uh, right click and open file location and over here you can see guys you can delete this option after updating if you're still facing black screen then it's very important to delete this folder right click and delete it close it and reopen your rpcs3 and reinstall your firmware files after deleting the folder file and install firmware files after these settings you can fix black screen on your rpcs3 i hope you like this video if you like it then please subscribe my channel and like my this video thanks for watching guys